hello friends welcome back to my channel if you're a returning subscriber and if this is your first time on this channel you are welcome my name is esther and welcome to another episode on the target series on target series i share information about how to apply to graduate programs in the usa and also how to get full scholarships in these universities in addition to this i also give tips on how to ace the visa interview that is the usa visa interview and also opportunities in working in the usa if these are the kind of content you are interested in please join the family by clicking on the subscribe button also don't forget to turn on your post notification bell so you don't miss out whenever i make a timely content because on target series this is application peak season so i'm dropping back to back content and you don't want to miss out on that on today's episode of the target series i'll be showing you how to apply to a land grant university in the usa for free that is you don't have to pay a dime to apply and also you don't have to worry about submitting the gre or the gmat test scores because this university is waiving test scores when you apply to them it will also interest you to know that this university is giving out full scholarships to all international students that are admitted or that are enrolled in their graduate degree programs come with me to my computer and let's learn about this university <laughs> The university we'll be discussing today is the Clemson University and it is one of the most productive public research universities in the nation as it attracts and unites students and faculty whose greatest desire is to make a difference in the lives of others. Let's explore Clemson by numbers. Here you have the number of undergraduate and graduate students and also a 93.6% first year retention rate. Clemson has 80 plus majors, 90 plus minors, and they have 130 plus graduate degree programs. As you can see, Clemson is founded in 1889 and it is located in the state of South Carolina in the United States. Let's explore the graduate programs they have at Clemson University. So here are different degree programs they have at Clemson University. And when you come to this link, which will be in the description below, you can search by degree name or you search by your interest. For you to use the search by your interest this is only applicable to undergraduate degrees only and if you scroll down you have different courses in this university that have been listed in alphabetical order so all you have to do is select on the alphabetical list for your graduate degree program that you're looking for or even the undergraduate degree program that you're looking for so right here you can see we have different programs and you can see for each program they've stated the program name the bachelor's degree master's degree and phd or even special studies so all you have to do is look at the programs you have interest in applying to and select whichever link you want if you want to study a master's in that program a bachelor's or even a phd so you see for some of the courses they have phd you see them they have a ticked for you to learn more and for some of the course they have masters you'll see them for the course that they don't have masters or phd you would see they have an empty tab on the links right here so here are some of the degree programs they have to offer at Clemson University. We can go through and just explore one of them. Um, I would want us to explore communication. We can explore and learn more under the master's program. So right here you can see masters of arts in communication science let's look at the application so you see the deadline to apply for masters in communication is february 1st with a rolling admission through march 1st for the following for the fall or september 30th for the following spring part time only so which means you have until february 1st or march 1st to submit your application for this degree program and these are the requirements you need a bachelor's degree you need a gpa of 3.0 and as you can see right here gr is scores optional so which means you can either submit your gre or if you don't have a gre score you can also apply to this school and they've stated that they will accept toefl ielts or the pt academic text scores other requirements are strong writing skills and specific detailed reasons for wanting to pursue a master's in communication science and all you have to do is click on apply to um to mscts today and that will take you to the application page 
let's explore the assistantship opportunity they have for this degree for example you can see assistantship provides a full tuition waiver and a monthly stipend for the academic year which ranges for nine months you can see the different assistantship they have teaching assistantship they have research assistantships and they also stated that assistantship are evaluated and renewed after one year based on your performance and academic standing which means for this program in this school, you have the option of submitting your application without a GRE score, free application and also full scholarship opportunity. Let's go ahead and explore another program. If you find the content in this video useful, please give it a thumbs up. This way, the YouTube will recommend it to others that would also find this content useful and will be able to grab this opportunity and target applying to this school. So moving down from communication science, you have different other programs that you can select based on your interest. I would want us to explore the economics program again. So you can see for a master's degree in economics, all you have to do is click on MA in economics. And for this, you have different relative informations for you to go through and you can submit first and informal application right here all you have to do is fill your name your first name last name your email your undergraduate institution your gpa your graduate institution if you have one graduate gpa if you have one note comment or questioning all you have to do is click on submit and that will be an informal application for this school to submit a formal application you can use this link below and that will take you to the link to complete a formal application for your program so moving away from economics, when you scroll down, you have different other programs, English, environmental engineering, food nutrition and culinary science, food nutrition, food science and human nutrition, genetics, geology, history, horticulture, hydrogeology. So for geology program, I would want to emphasize this for those of you that have been sending me questions relating to this program of study in particular. So in this school, they have a geology bachelor's degree program. However, they have hydrogeology for master's program. So if you're interested in studying a master's in hydrogeology option, then let's explore this opportunity together. So right here on their portal for the hydrogeology master's degree program, you can see the Department of Environmental and Engineering at Earth Sciences and Clemson University houses environmental engineering, biosystems engineering, and earth sciences in the same department. And you can see it states here that graduate applicants, no application fee or GRE is required. So if you have interest in submitting your application for the hydrogeology master's degree program, you'll be submitting your application for free. Also, you do not need to submit the GRE test score. All you have to do is click on apply below. So here are different research areas that they have in the master's of science in hydrology. If you have interest in environmental geochemistry, geophysics, tectonics, hydrometrics, techniques, hydrostratigraphy, geostatistics, environmental remediation, groundwater contaminant flow and transport modeling, then you can submit your application for free without the GRE score in Clemson University. You can also look at the curriculum and you can look at further requirements applying to the MS degree. So you can see for admission to MS, an applicant should have a grade point of at least 3.0 out of 4.0. And these are further information on how you can apply. So these are all that degree programs they have in this school. Feel free to explore them based on your interest. And most of them are waiving the GRE. And also you have an opportunity to get a full scholarship as an international student. And also for you to note, most of this application is free for you. I hope you're able to grab this opportunity and target submitting your application to Clemson University as soon as possible. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've been able to learn about the different graduate degree programs that they have available in Clemson University. And I hope you intend to target submitting your application to that school for free. I'll see you in another episode on the Target series. Until then, guys, stay tuned. Peace.